G'day mates, how's it going? Uh, Jaden here and Sheldon. Other man couldn't be here because he's a bit special, but should be right. Uh, today we're opening up seven Yu-Gi-Oh boxes, uh, mystery box things from Cherry. Uh, let's just get into it. I believe you have a, what is it, 1 in 12, 1 in 24 chance in a booster box to get a Ghost Rare Secret, a uh, Ghost Rare Raw. Yeah. That'd be, I'd shit myself. Sorry about the language, but if we got a Ghost Rare, oh, dang it. Rare Wild Monster appears. Disappointing. <sighs> Still good cut. Alright, now I'll crack these open real quick. Yep. And we are back. So we're opening them last, them also last, and these three last as well. I reckon we're going to start off with the big packs. Um, I don't know. Chaos. Should I do these? Because there's only two of these. Mm. Yeah, I reckon Team Chaos first. Alright. Alright. So, uh, I'm going to remember how to open cards. I'm sorry. It's been a while. So, what, what year do you reckon these were released? 2020. So, they're the new ones. There we go, I did it. Sorry for the excess noise, guys. I'm using my manners. <laughs> Whatever, I'll, I'll do this. Manners don't always work, guys. Manners don't always work. Okay. Gonna create a bit of a mess. Chaos Sorcerer. That's a rare. Supervise. Black Luster Soldier. Ooh. Chaos Emperor Dragon. I like that. That art. Mm. I don't know why, I just love the purple ring. It's a very old card, that. Yeah. Cyframe Driver. So what, is it, are they all gonna be like, gold? Like I think things? so. Gearbred, a uh, breed, and Magician of Hope. Nice. That's a boss card, isn't it? Or whatever. No, that's just a... Uh... Oh, I've never actually seen an XC's Pendulum. I have. Okay. There's quite a lot of them. Are they? The funny thing is, I sort of bought that card online. What, this? Yes. When? Like, the fourth. Because it's part of my deck. Do you need another one? Mm, I mean, I probably might take another one. Yep. In case. Alright, uh, uh, if you want. Okay. Now for the second one. There we go. Guys, when you have no nails, it hurts. Because <laughs> it literally... Oh gosh, it just hurts. I've never actually been able to open these like this before. Have you? you have... I don't know. I open them a different way. You just open it like... Yeah, I just tear down the back of them. Uh, I'm just doing it like this because it looks fancy. <laughs> Okay, now, let's see what we got. Stardust Ooh, Dragon. Nice. Common. I, I think that's my second. No, isn't that rare? Good Friday. Yeah, yeah it is. Uh, I think there's I think uh, gonna be majority rare, and then one foil at the back. Yeah. So we're gonna the Black Luster, Curse of the Dragonfire, uh, number 68, I can't read that because it's shiny as heck, Masked Hero Goka, Masked Hero Deanne, and Subliminate, not, uh, Sublim, Subliminate, Knight. Sublimination. <laughs> <In the> words. <laughs> Alright. Um, I'm gonna just sleeve that bad boy up. I'm not sure if this is worth it. Okay, now, 
moving on to the next packs. We're gonna go on to these ones just because I hear they're a bit lackluster in cards, but we'll do it anyway for you guys. Once I finish struggling to open, there we go. Again, I'm still surprised that I can do that. <laughs> So what was it, 18 cards in this? Yes. Okay. And there's about 10 cards that are worth something. 10 yeah. cards, what are they? Um, alternative art, normal named, uh, Dark Magician Girl, the Dragon Knight. Okay. Uh, you've got the normal version art, uh, normal named version of Toon Kingdom. And right. there's a couple offers that I can't exactly remember. Alright, so we got Mirror Force Dragon, Mount of the Bound Creator, Guardian Eta Etos, Etos? Yados. Yados. Or Rank Yados. up Magic Admiration of the th of Thousands. Blackwing Hurricane and the Tornado. I, I, I remember back when I first, like, well, not first, like, I got back into Yu Gi Oh! And I, I wanted to make a Blackwing deck so badly. <laughs> But I could never find anyone that was willing to trade them. Guardian Dreadsight. Train Connection. Doom Virus Dragon. That looks nice. It is a very nice looking card. I will admit that. Um, we'll sleep that up in a second. And Flower Guardian Light Shower. That is also quite nice. Mm. Especially looking at the camera there. Wow. Oh! It comes with three foils. Number 45, Crumble Logo, uh, Logo's the Prophet Demolition, Demolition, that's quite nice, and then, Oracalus Shunderus, number 98, Prediction Princess, Raid Raptor, Blade Burner Falcon, Performer, Fa Perfor Performer Power Uni, number 59, Night Express Knight, uh, Prediction Princess, Eros, Sliff, I don't know. I'm not good at English, guys. For those who know me, they would say I'm quite an expert at not talking correctly. Now we'll quickly sleeve these bad boys up. What do you reckon, uh, what, what's the best thing you reckon we've pulled so far out of the, the booster packs? Um, so far I would say something from the... Toon? Yeah, the first two packs. Which one was that one? Uh, these? Um, or I believe or probably the... Sublin uh, Sublination Knight or Magician of Hope. I'm enjoying the Magician of Hope's, like, art style. Hmm. Uh, just because I'm a sucker for uh, white shiny things. <laughs> I'm a fucking kid, I swear. <laughs> JC was here, he'd back me up. Yeah. Alright, so far we've got those, and then this bad boy. And at the moment, we don't have any very special sleeves, just no. ones you get from your generic car game store. Still does the job. Just as effective as any other special sleeves. Okay, now uh, we're going to do something special. The cameraman. Another one. Cameraman gets to go. Um, for me, this is a very special way to open them. <laughs> very right special. Right down the back way. <laughs> Makes it quicker it's pretty, and easier. It's thick for 18 cards, isn't it? Mm. Alright, let's see what we got. Rising Sun Slash. Ooh. Goddess Bow. Hey, hey, tunes. I've got a special place for those tunes. <laughs> Just because they look so derpy. <laughs> Lion-hearted locomotive, and a passing psychroid amulet dragon. I believe that is a good. Here, yeah, bring it over here. Um, uh, green yeah. name though, unfortunately. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Uh, blue name seal of Orichalcos. and enough at number forty-five. Crumble logos, the prophet demolition. Dang, that's disappointing. Sure. But uh, that's okay. Uh, Despair Uranus, Flower Cardian Zebra Grass, Aquatrius Tetra, number 51, the Finisher Strong Arm, Toon Rollback, okay. Night Express in the Night, and Aquarium Stage. Well, that was, uh, I mean, the Amulet Dragon looks quite nice. Mm. 
I do like the, um... The sealed of our calcus. Oh, yeah. No, that and the fact that the amulet dragon has all the writing around it. Wait, does it? Oh, wow. I did not even know that. Look at that, guys. Surely everyone else knew that. Alright. You get to pick one more. What do you want to open? We shall open for a special... The secret slides. Let me just get up real quick. We hit the 20 minute mark. Ooh, cursed Eldland. That looks Ooh. really nice. That's gorgeous. Are they all going to be foils? I think so. That's heaps of... Adamantopacia Raptite. So you said we can get... Uh, Eldlick the Golden Lord himself. And I think there are some Starlights in here, yes. <gasps> Kanzashi the Rick Queen. Upstart Goblin. Oh god, that is some now next level shininess for that one. Yeah, oh Ooh. wow. Sigura Hakura of the Golden Land. Is that the last one? It looks like it, yes. Wow, look at that. So I believe there is one secret rare in these packs. Okay. Um, do we want to quickly sleep these up? Uh, we will sleep them up as soon as possible. Uh, we'll, uh... We are back. Yep. Sorry, we uh, just take a little break. And we sleeved up the cards that we yep. got. And reorganized it. This is the only uh, secret rare we've got besides... The ones in the special sleeves. Alright. Now we're gonna... We've got four more of these ones to do. Gosh. Fuck it. My fingers hurt too much. I'm a pussy, I know. <laughs> Leave me alone. The big packs are always a bit of a pain to open. Okay. So we're in another Mount of the Bound creator. Red Eyes Black Dragon Sword! I've got three of those at home. <laughs> uh, if there's anything special, I'm sure Sheldon will tell you. Lord of the Red is... eh? It's an alright yeah. ritual monster for dragons. Okay, Galaxy Stealth Dragon. Ooh, very nice. Yeah. Oh, I'm Green loving that one. And Legendary Knight Hermos. That is the... Normal name, so that is one of the good knights. You went another seal of Oracalcus. Seal of Oracalcus, is that normal name or green? Ah, uh, that's normal. Like, uh, is that that's special, uh, special gold name? Yeah. So it's worth more than the one over here, ish. Yes. Maybe I don't know. Oh, okay. Hermos is purple named. Oh, okay. You can see it from here now. Ah, oh, yep. Yeah. So we just got a bunch of random stuff, nothing too uh, Amazing. exciting, but nonetheless cards. And uh, I would like to just quickly put in this little plug-in. Uh, we will have a website up in the next week or so from today. Uh, what's today? The something or other? Mm. But yeah, I uh, believe it's the 18th. The 18th of November 2020. Within a week from now, we will have a website up uh, with these cards available for trading or buying. Um, so, if you see anything here that you want, basically all of it's going up. Basically. If there it, are some things we will keep for ourselves. Yeah. Some special cards or cards that we like to use. Yeah. Um, as we are also dueling, trying to convince our local game shop to open... A game spot yeah. for Yu-Gi-Oh. And if that happens, we'll be filming in there a lot more. Yes. Uh, the next video that you guys will see uh, is actually us opening maximum gold there. Um, we pulled some all right stuff. Some very decent. I, I'm I'm a really f big fan of how the cards look. The style, the gold, maximum gold set itself looks amazing. Yes, they really, Konami really outdone themselves. Like, their previous maximum gold was alright, but. Yeah. But meh, compared to these. Alright, let's get straight into it. Yep, enough of Dragons of Legend. Yeah, just want to get them out of the way. Why do I hate myself? I swear I hate myself. I mean, we'll also try to upload 
on like either a weekly or a fortnightly basis. Yeah. Uh, if we don't do opening video, it will be like just a random Scr duel. Yeah, just screwing around on YGO Pro or something like that. Yeah. Okay, get ready. Mathematician. Ooh. Purple name. Uh, it's got foil. I do like how the glasses are foiled as well. Hmm. But, uh, but me personally, I'm not a big fan of it. Ra's Disciple. That'd, uh, that'd be pretty cool if it was actually... If Ra was actually a good card. <laughs> From what I've noticed, there's a set that's come out in the OCG that, Look at that. is giving the God cards a lot more support. Yeah. Hopefully we don't get that. <laughs> Makes the gods a little bit more competitive now. Yeah. I don't want to see what happens in the OCG anymore. Those guys just need to chill with what's going over there, on over there. The yeah. only thing we need from the OCG is the hieroglyphic box yes. they have with the god cards in it. I will be trying my very best to be getting some of those cards. Um, and no, they won't be on the site. <laughs> <laughs> As most OCG stuff is not legal here in the TCG format. Yeah, unless you can actually speak it. But besides that, no, not even. Yeah. Like, generally, it's yeah, only, it's only if, if it's in the TCG originally. Yeah. I mean, the card, like, alternative card arts and all that are legal as long as you have the translated version of the card. But if it's a tournament, like a YCS or a world championship, they will not allow it. Yep. I think you even have to ask uh, permission to use, like, uh, tokens, like special tokens or something. Um, I believe tokens are fine, because they are just tokens you're using for your actual thing. Yeah. Um, different name cards, like, say you had a card from Germany, and you still had the other card version of it, like yeah. an Ash Blossom. Say you had two Ash Blossoms, and they were in, like, a secret pair. And one was if English was... and one was German. Yes. You if can... okay. Ash Blossom came in secret rare, I don't know if that is the case. Doesn't it come in secret rare? In, Wait. Are possibly in Dual Devastators. I've yeah. not opened the set myself. I myself have been a big fan of Yu-Gi-Oh for like 15, yes. 16 years, but probably about two years ago I took a good long two year break. break from the game because of all the new stuff that yeah, came out. It, just it overwhelmed me. Especially all the hand traps they released in that set. Yeah. It really got to my nerves on how annoying can, um, the can gameplay be... was because Ooh. you would do one thing and the whole process would get interrupted by one specific card. Yeah, especially with Dragoon. Of course. Dragoon coming out this year was probably one of the biggest blunders I'd say that Konami's done so far. Yeah. It is a very Ooh. power crept. Ooh, here we go. That's really nice. Yeah, sadly, blue name. Blue name, Numeron Dragon. But uh, I like the art style on that, and... Toon Kingdom. Kingdom. Is that, I believe, yes. the normal name? Yeah, no, that's uh, gold shiny. Yeah, that's the normal name. Okay. Okay. So what are we opening? Battles of Legend. Hero's Revenge. Um, Look at that. that I don't actually cool. know anything about this set. I believe this might contain... Elemental Heroes, and what looks to be maybe Tenyi or oh, wow. Yang Zing. 2017 pack. So yes, this was this is a 2020 reduced right when I was... At least when I took a break from Yu-Gi-Oh! at least. Yeah. From opening card packs. Um, Hopefully we get something good. What do you, what do you reckon? We'll Ooh, wow. Look yes. at that. Here we go. Some interesting cards. It looks like they will be foils. Okay. Uh, Dragon Necro, Never Soul Dragon. Wow. Vision Hero, Minimum Ray. Gold co Moon Coin. Add two That's cards from your hand to your opponent's hand. I've never seen that before. That's interesting. Then draw what two cards? So, that would... Vision Hero, Trinity. Oh, wow. And Elemental Oi. Hero, Neos Knight. Or Neos, for those people who like to be technical. Uh, We're Aussie, we rare. don't care how we pronounce things. Yeah, we just like to pronounce cards. 
So we got two secret rares thus far. Yes. From uh, packs that are generally guaranteed to contain at least one secret rare. And to be fair, the Neos Knights looks quite nice. Yeah. It's got a very nice. I like shine how to the it. shield is even shiny. Alrighty, now. Oh, sorry. I just attacked the cameraman. <laughs> I swear it wasn't on purpose. Cough, cough. And the cameraman shall attack back soon. Ha <laughs> ha It's time to duel! You know, no, you know, no, no, you know. Alright, let's go. So this one is Battles uh, of Armageddon. Legend. Armageddon. Um. So that's Judgment Dragon, is it? I would... Yes, that is Judgment Dragon. So did this set come out this year? Yeah, 2020. Hmm. That might, must mean that there's probably released... Or a re release of Judgment Dragon and maybe Light Sworn... Um, support. Yeah. I don't know why, I just love the look of Judgment Dragon. <laughs> it is a... It's a decent... Um... Light Swans themselves are a very good archetype. Light Swans? Um, very good for swarming the grave and special summoning a lot of monsters out. Now I remember the pack. Uh, generally they get either Judgment or, um, Light, no, not Light End Dragon. I think it's Doom Dragon or something. Yeah. To basically nuke the field. Oh, wow. That's gorgeous. Slightly ugly, but gorgeous. <laughs> mm, number two, is that? Yep. N Numeron Gate Drive. Necros of Gungi. Gungnir? Oh, so the Necros have been reprinted in this pack as well. Salaman Great Gazelle. That looks quite nice. Hmm. And then Assault Blackwing. Sohia. So Sohaya the Rainstorm. Look at that. And then Fossil Warrior Skull King. That's beautiful. And very interesting secret rare art. Yeah, let's quickly sleeve that bad boy up. Uh, what do you reckon we should open next? Should we continue to get the Dragon of Legends out of the way? Okay, we decided to skip through the commons of the last two Dragons of Legend packs. Um, we got a Flower Cardian Light Sworn again, or Light Shower, sorry. Uh, Legendary Knight Critias. A normal named Ra's Disciple, which I believe we didn't get before. Uh, no, we got a purple name. So right that's here. a nice one. Purple named Ra's Disciple. A uh, green comic hand. A blue named Toon Kingdom this time. Yeah. And a Paladin of Dark Dragon. That's pretty neat. Uh, we're just going to sleeve these up and we'll be right back. Alright, so what are we doing? We're opening up Secret Slayers. Yep. And I think uh, the interesting thing the one you were going for. Yeah, I think the interesting thing would be to get an old pack from like 2002, like a Legend of Blue Eyes. Yes. Um, our cherry at the moment is offering $20,000 for a Legend of Blue Eyes set. Upstart Goblin. Oh wow, Nine Tail Fox. Koki Meru Guardian, I believe is how these cards are pronounced. Adamantipate, uh, Laputite, and, and Eldorado Atlantite. I'm not even going to butcher the name of it, because it's a very interesting name. Yes. But it's a very beautiful secret rare yeah. as well. Check it in. So, sleeve this one up. Yep. We, uh, we like to sleeve our cards. It might be an addiction of ours. <laughs> I swear, uh, we're not we're not crazy. I promise. Promises are not actually kept on here. <laughs> nah. Uh, what do we got? Koki Maru Overlord. So we're getting another uh, Koki. Koki Maru Sandman. Rose Lover. Oh wow. Uh, actually, take a look at that. That's quite nice. A very beautiful looking card. And then... Adamantipate a Crystal Dragite. Yes, second. And, and Rika Sheet. Oh, wow. That's actually nice. JC would fucking love that. <laughs> <laughs> Our friend JC is a very waifu lover kind yeah. of person. Uh, we will be 
doing a waifu deck review or uh, packs opening eventually and he will be the one opening them but again sorry he couldn't be here today Adam Emancipator Crystal Leonite so so with Adam Emancipator it seems like there are a lot of rock yeah uh, Marina Princess of Sunflowers enough of like overload is that another same one? Yep. What's that? Tiraburni, Princess of Autumn Leaves. Wow. And Rika Flurries. Wow. So we've got a Rika Sheet and a Rika Flurry. Okay. So what deck does that belong in? Um, I believe Rikas are their own, like, plant type archetype. Okay, so these are the Sigurus we've got thus far. Come on, let's pull an Eld, uh, an Eldlick Golden Lord. Yep. Pull something awesome. Adam Mantapesa Ryzen. I love that one. Raptite. We got, uh, we got that one before, but... Golden Land name. Forever. Trap Trick. Very good staple in nearly every kind of deck. Ill Blood. I hate that card, it looks weird. Very ugly Gemini zombie. Yeah. And, and Guardian of the Golden oh, Land. Wow, that's gorgeous. I believe Eldlick in this set is a secret rare. That's beautiful. Well. So I believe most of his support cards, and including himself, are all secret rares. Yeah. Alright, is that the last one? Yep. Alright, we'll be right back. We're just going to quickly sleeve these. Okay, so now we are opening our Legendary Duelist Magical Hero. There are um, quite a few, I believe, Dark Magician support 20, cards. 17 here. pack. Um, fairly an old, uh, fairly older set. Uh, well, compared to most today's set. This was back before they actually made it where... Foils were guaranteed. Yeah, and also that Ooh. you right. are more than less pretty much guaranteed to get foils because yeah. they got rid of rares and commons. Yeah. And I believe... Well, not commas, they just got rid of all generic rares because yeah. rares are pretty much pointless to create. One thing I did uh, enjoy opening Yu Gi Oh packs when I was a kid was uh, the fact that how rare foils were to get. Yeah. And going to school and like saying, like fighting with your friends, saying, <laughs> oh, I want that, I want that, you know. Um, yeah, it looks like a very orientation. To what looks to like to be pretty much all the main characters from Dual Monsters uh, and GX. Not GX. No? Um, uh, Arc 5. What about that one? And possibly, um, yeah, Arc 5. Uh, so basically, support for from Dual Monsters to to uh, Zexel uh, or Arc 5 as you have cards for fusion summoning you have your Dark Magician support you have your tuners and synchros and all that and you have your pendulum monsters and I'm opening this pack here wrong way I'm proud of you but it will be fine she will be right and up a doppel warrior number F0 utopic what? future oh wow I cannot be bothered to try and pronounce these because uh, it's... Onomatoperia? I don't know. These names are really weird I for the archetype they belong to. spewed out the alphabet like, yeah. Future Drive, enough of a utopic future card. Okay, yep. Those are three so rares. Hollows, which is interesting. Fingers crossed we can get a holo. How cool would it be if we got a holo dark condition? <laughs> Grant me the power of... Or oh, hollow freaking dark magician girl. Cosmic Blazar Dragon. Oh, that's, a, that's an awesome art. That's interesting to see in common art, though. Yeah. Chronograph Sorcerer. And a... Co Ooh. We got a hollow... <gasps> Rev D Magician Dark Illusion. And hollow Satellite Synchro. Oh, yeah. You take it in? Ooh, that is a, look a nice card. card. That's actually quite nice. Alright, this is the haul. Um, we're gonna end the video here. I know we've still got 
some other packs to open, being these three, but you, I'm sure you'll see it. I'm sure you will. But uh, anyway, besides that, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you do, leave a like and subscribe and comment what your favourite card was today that we pulled. If you have multiple favourites, comment them, why not? Uh, we'll see you in the next video. See ya!